Hey guys, so today's video is gonna be super casual. It is officially summer break, so you're probably gonna see little sprinkles of these kind of casual type of videos more throughout the summer, just because the boys will be home a little bit more and I will be spending some more time with them throughout the summer. We're about to make some lunch, then we're gonna go do a few things, and then I'm going to show you guys my newest Chanel head bag. So I was actually gonna do like a dedicated video for that unboxing, but I just don't know when I'll have a chance to film it, so I figured I would just do it here. Plus, I'm ready to get it up in my in my closet and get it put away and get the, the box and the bag put away. It's kind of taking up some space in the office. Um, so I'm gonna show you that in a little bit when we get back, but first, let's go ahead and make some lunch. So today's video is actually sponsored by HelloFresh. You guys know I love HelloFresh. We've been getting their delivery service for a little bit, and their food is delicious. If you are not familiar with HelloFresh, it is a meal delivery service. You get pre-portioned, meals that are already like ready for you recipes and everything yesterday we actually made the crispy cheese and veggie fajitas they were amazing i'm thinking for lunch today we are going to do this cheese tortellini and the mushroom sauce all the ingredients are pre-packaged pre-portions for each individual recipe which i personally love i'm not a big cook i don't love to cook but these are really easy everything is within 30 minutes and like i said because everything is pre-portioned you don't have to buy each individual like ingredient from the grocery store and a lot of it gets wasted most of the time so yes i love these i do have an 80 dollars off your first HelloFresh box so check that down below there's a code for that and like i said you can get 80 dollars off your first box it's a great box i do the four person box so we get three meals for four people like four servings per each meal whether you are a fan of cooking or you are not i actually really recommend these boxes so if you're a fan of cooking these kind of branch you out and you get to try different ingredients together ways that you probably wouldn't pair them and if you're not a fan of cooking it's just such an easy effortless way to cook get meals on the table in 30 minutes or less so like i said i will put the 80 dollars off coupon code on the screen as well as in the info box down below but i'm going to call the boys down because we are going to make lunch together. Lunch is served guys and it's actually really good. I've already tasted it. I did add a little bit of red pepper. They did include a little bit of red pepper in the box as well. If you wanted to garnish it and I added it, it's so good. I love mushrooms though, but anything kind of with mushrooms and kind of a cream sauce is delicious. Make sure to check out the code and the link down below for $80 off your first HelloFresh box. Okay, all these little beach hats are so cute. Kind of digging this one. It says daydreaming. Look at that one. Look at all these little cover ups. This one is really cute. It's by Time and True, $16. That's really cute. That's a cute cover up. Oh, I like the yellow one. That one's super cute. I'll try to find these and link them for you below. Oh, look at this one. Summer vibes. That's cute. Oh, that's a cute little cover up. A little kimono. Comes in red too. Kind of like this white one. And then these visors I know are, are really popular. I might have to try one of these on. It's cute. Okay, so I don't think this is how you're supposed to wear these. I would probably do like a messy bun, but this is the little visor, guys. What do you think? Do you think that's cute? It is probably around $5. Yes, it's $4.94. I think it's really cute. I might grab this. Cute. I'll link it down below if I can find it for y'all. But five bucks, and I know these are really popular right now. Okay, what do you guys think of this baseball cap? It is a like 
woven straw baseball cap. It says tropical vibes. It's very different, but I kind of like it. I'm definitely gonna buy the, vis the visor. I don't know, should I get this one too? Let me know down below if you like this or not. It's really cute. Okay, I don't think I like this one on me, but I just wanted to show you guys because they have such a wide variety of hats here right now. Fun, this one comes in three colors. Comes in this color, white, and then a black color with the like little, little leather trim. This is a cute little like classic floppy hat. This one is $5, guys. It is $4.97. It's got a cute little um, like band here and it comes in one, two, three, five, five or six different colors. Like I said, I'll try to link it down below for you guys, but this is a really good one. It's not like too crazy, right? It's pretty simple, pretty classic. It's gonna give you some coverage, but also just like a little style element. Super cute. Okay, I had to show you guys these little totes. How cute is this? This is 1888, it's from Time and True. Little accent there. And then they also have like these. Cute, right? I just had to show you those. Look at this one right here. Super cute, ooh, I like this floral one. Floral one's really cute. There's some, and then they have like the neutral canvas and then they have the, the green canvas. I kind of like that one. And then a floral here. Those are super cute. Oh, there's a little straw. Oh, this is cute. Okay, I love this. That is really cute. Look at it, it says Aloha. That's really cute. I wanted to show you guys these basics. These are from Time and True. Um, I like these. They have a V-neck, which is always my favorite. And then they have like the solid gray over here. I get asked all the time about like affordable ba basics. These are good. I definitely think you would need to go up a size though if you want like a looser fit like I generally like. Um, but yes, I love this gray color right here, super cute. Let me open it up for you. So here is the small, I know this is not a very good view for you guys, sorry. Um, I think it would actually fit nicely, but I still would probably go up one size for like a more comfortable fit. Okay, now these are kind of a must have, guys. These are a four inch inseam, and they are $9.94. So that is a size small right there. That's what I would probably go for. It comes in green, white, a cream color, and then black, and then a chambray. The chambray is super, super cute. Let me find a, a size to show you guys. Oh look, it even had, they even have like this stripe color. That's really cute too. Um, love the chambray. Oh, there's more stripes down there. Look at those. These are really cute. Look at those, those are super cute. These are a good buy. I'd grab a couple of these. These are gonna get you through the entire summer. You need khaki, green, and I would go with like a chambray, and then maybe one or two. There's a few different stripe options. Okay guys, these pants are so cute. I don't know if the camera is gonna really pick up the detail. You've got a little tie waist, with this little like elastic thing. They're from Time and True. They are $16. Really fun and cute. It's got the blue color, the navy, this pink color. I'm obsessed with this pattern. How fun would that be in a pant? And I think that's it. I love these. I actually really want them in this pattern. So I'm gonna have to find them online. They're very, they just have a few sizes here right now of this pant, but I love, let me pull this out and I can just show you what they look like in this pattern. How cute are those? Look, it's kind of like a little wide, wide leg with that detail. Okay, I love these. I'm gonna have to order these online in my size. I really like them. We had to come and get some food for Petunia and I've actually been buying her this stuff. It's in the refrigerated, actually freezer section and they have chicken, lamb, and beef and she prefers the beef one but I usually buy the big bag. So, oh, they're on sale right now buy one get one 50% off so I guess I'll get two bags of these they are kind of expensive but she really likes them so we'll get two bags there you go hold that please yeah. let's grab one more oh. they're on sale but yeah these are really good really healthy she doesn't have any teeth so it's easier for her to eat and of course since they're raw no corn no grain no wheat no soy no artificial colors or preservatives um, it's just a lot healthier for her if you don't wanna deal with thawing out the fruit every single time you feed your dog, which I will admit is kind of a pain in the butt because it takes about 15 minutes, 20 minutes or so, this is the same brand, but it's like the same concept. So this is kibble with the raw booster in it. 
obviously this is totally not sponsored this is just what I started feeding Petunia and she really likes it so I even buy these for the other dogs and I will mix these because it's these are dehydrated oh my phone's ringing like I said I would just buy these and actually just kind of mix them in with the other dogs kibble because it's the raw boosters it's the same little like pieces that you see here mixed in with their normal kibble um, but it's the same concept it's they're raw but they're freeze seized freeze dried raw so yeah these are just a little bit healthier if you like that kind of stuff they have all kinds of different flavors i've been buying these for the other dogs too because they still use they still eat blue but i might actually switch them to this kibble once we um, run out of because i usually just buy the big bags and i buy them in bulk i buy a couple but they have the big bags too with the um see so they have kibble as well as the raw dehydrated um pieces in there too I'm gonna go ahead and get Lexi some of this grass. I bought her this kind last time and she did not like it, but I know she likes this kind, so I'll get this for her as well. Oh my goodness, guys, it is hot out there. It's so hot and we weren't even really like outside that long. I did get a few things from Walmart. I did buy these little shorts. I got them in white. Uh, I love the khaki color, like in the green khaki color as well, and all the stripes. But I have several, like I have one or two pair of very similar shorts in khaki as well as that green shade. So I thought I would get the white because I don't have it. But if you do not have these, these were $10, $9.94. If they have them available online, I will link them. They also have like a Capri version, same exact style, except just like a longer length. And I did pick up both of those hats. I got the visor in the natural, which I thought was super cute. I thought it was cute. Let me know. I mean, yeah, the lighting in here is not that good, but I got the visor and then I got the floppy hat. Both of those were $5, guys. So those would be good little just accessories for the beach, for the pool, just to have really affordable. But let's get... Let's get to the good stuff, guys. Let's get to the good stuff. So we've got, of course, my Chanel unboxing. I've been dying to look at this. Again, I haven't looked at it since I bought it in the store because um, I wanted to do a true little unboxing of Chanel. This is my first Chanel handbag to purchase from the store. The This is, would be my second Chanel handbag, Chanel bag, because the first Chanel, bless you, Patoons, the first Chanel bag that I have, I purchased it pre-loved. So I obviously didn't get all the beautiful packaging and everything. Oop, and I just messed up the ribbon, but it's okay. So here is the box. Let's see, my receipt and everything was in the other box that I showed you guys with the earrings and stuff. If you haven't seen that, I will link it up at the top corner for you guys. But yes, here it is. I got a camellia. I did get a camellia on the earrings as well. Let's open this baby up. I'm excited about this one. So this actual bag, I wasn't like wasn't necessarily on my wish list, but there's a feature about it that was on my wish list in regards to Chanel. So here's the packaging. It's so beautiful. Let's break the Chanel seal. Ready? Let's do it together. Oh, it smells delicious. It smells amazing. We're unboxing this together. Granted, I know what it is. But here's the, here is the bag. Oh, what do we have? Oh, here's the cloth. I think he, I think that's the cloth, the, the dusting cloth. Oh, he like, it's all beautiful down there. It's perfectly folded. I think that's what this is. Let's see what this is. I, I, he said he was going to include a cloth for me. Is that typical? Is that normal? I don't know. Oh yes, so it is a little Chanel dusting cloth, which is pretty cool. I think that's what that is. It's like hard or something. Hmm, that's different. And then I don't know what is on this side. Some little booklet or something. Probably just like the care booklet. Very, very cool. Okay, here is the bag that it came in. It's sideways, so you might be able to tell kind of what it is. Oh my goodness, it's so beautiful. I don't, I don't know if this is the one that I actually tried on in store or if they had like another one in stock or he just re-wrapped it, but it's all wrapped up. Are you guys ready? You ready? I'm really excited. And the bag that I picked is the Gabrielle backpack. So I really fell in love with, well, I don't want to say I fell in love. I've always been in love with two-tone Chanel. There's just something about it that I love two-tone Chanel. So I knew I wanted to add a two-tone Chanel piece to my collection. And um, originally I wanted the filigree backpack in two-tone. One, that wasn't available, but two, when I played with the filigree backpack, and I'll insert a picture on the screen just so you know which one I'm talking about. 
I didn't like the way that it opened and closed, and then I didn't like the way that the magnetic flap folded down. Um, I really preferred the Chanel backpack, like the classic Chanel backpack, which I'll also put a picture as well, because that one had the clasp, um, but that one only comes in white, uh, cause I'm, I mean, I'm sorry, in black, and it does come in a few other colors, but I just didn't, I just didn't really like that one. This one is so easy to get in and out of, and this is also the largest size. So it is a smaller backpack. I will admit I was a little, you guys know kind of how I feel about backpacks. I wasn't sure that I would like the size of this one, um, but because of the way that it opens and closes, I really, really like it. I think it's gonna be a very functional bag for me. It doesn't really require anything. Like you don't have to find a button. You don't have to find a clasp. You just put it on and let me show you. Okay, another thing that I really love is there are four different metals um, on the chain. There is a matte gold, there is a shiny gold, there is a palladium, and then there is a shiny silver. Um, so it's really gonna match with everything. You guys know I'm obsessed with mixing metals and my accessories. Um, so I love that. I thought that this was, you, you guys know the Gabrielle line is a classic line of Chanel. It's not going anywhere, but I love that they, it looks a little bit more modern with the mixed metal. So this I feel like is kind of like a mix of old and new, but all in one bag. I think it's beautiful. The main hardware right there is that kind of um, antique silver. You literally just go like that and it's open. And then to close it, you literally just grab it and it closes. Um, Size-wise, it's not gonna be very big. I would say that's probably gonna be comparable to my Pochette Matisse kind of size. Um, I'll show you the inside. It does have the beautiful, of course, maroon lining. There is one, one card slot right here in the back. I'll try to give you guys a good view. Here you go. It's a little dark in here. Hopefully you can see it. My full size wallet will fit in there. If you guys want me to do a what's in my, my backpack, what's in my Chanel bag, let me know. But see how easy that opens and closes? You literally just go like this and then grab it. To, once you grab it to put it on, it just closes on its own. There's really no thinking about it. The only thing I will say I wish this bag had is I do wish that it had feet on the bottom, but again, it's a backpack, so I'm not ever gonna probably really set it down. I will just be wearing it, but I think it's so cute. I love it. Like I said, you guys know, I one, I wanted a backpack from Chanel, and two, I wanted a two-tone piece. Like I said, when it comes to backpacks, I think functionality, in my opinion, don't get me wrong, I see some really, really cute ones, the teeny weeny weeny ones, and just, they're cute, they're great, I know. But for me, I want a backpack to be functional, so I think this one's gonna be really functional, especially just because of how easy it is to open and close. Um, and then I think it's gonna be super functional as far as the straps. It's not like gonna be like dig into you because they're, they're pretty thin. Um, if you're gonna be able to wear it with anything. I'll be able to wear it with browns or blacks because of the two-tone. I love it. Let me know down below what do you guys think. Do you love it? Is this what you expected? A lot of you guys thought I was gonna get a backpack and you were right. So that is it guys. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with us today. It was kind of a chill day. Like I said, really, really casual. It is officially a summer break. Make sure to check out the links down below. I will put the $80 off for your first box of HelloFresh. Oh, here's Lexi. Lexi, come say hi. <laughs> Did you wanna come say hi? Come here, come here. Let me get her to say hi. Come here, Lexi. Oh, look at that pretty baby. <laughs> Aww. She's so sweet. Say hi, Lexi. Isn't she beautiful, guys? I haven't given her her grass yet. Maybe I'll, I'll, I'll show you guys, I'll give it to her. Let's, it's right behind me. Or, oh, look at her. Oh, you're so sweet, Lexi. Get some lovin's. She's been hanging out in this room ever since I started, I'm not finished in here too, by the way, but ever since I started kind of rearranging in here and I added the rug, she's been hanging out in here, which I don't love the idea of because she scratches the furniture. That's one of the things about having cats. Even like the best behaved cat, they just kind of, they, they, they need a place to scratch and she has scratch pads all over the house. And even with that, every once in a while, she'll try to see like, can I scratch on this? And she'll try it out. She already tried scratching this corner right here and I kind of caught her. There's like a baby, baby, baby little peels, but I caught her. She hasn't done it since. So hopefully I scared her enough for her to realize that that, that is not your scratch pad. Right, Lexa? That is not your scratch pad. Right. Oh, you're so sweet. Okay. Oh. <laughs> okay, well, we are gonna go guys and I will see you guys in my next video. Talk to you soon. Bye-bye.